Welcome to Ucanic. Today here in Ucanic we have this USB camera. For this one we're going to go over some of the features that come with this camera and the uses and what you can use it for on your vehicle. So this is a USB connected camera slash um, sometimes people call this a video scope and or a boroscope to be able to check into the tight compartments of your engine so that you don't have to take it completely apart to be able to find um, to see if there's some internal damages on different things. So uh, some of the features that we have with this, we have the, the flexible cable and that it will hold its shape once you get it in to where the, the bend you need it to be. Um, plug this in here. It doesn't run on its own power. It runs on the power from your scanner. So as we turn on the screen there, and now when it's plugged in, we have the options here to be able to snap a photo here and then also to turn on uh, the, uh, the light. And so we have a light to be able to see in the dark confined spots of our engine, especially inside the cylinders by when you open up the spark plug or remove the spark plug to be able to see in there. got a few different settings on the light so you click to do it two or three times to be able to get to the brightness that you want. Now this little tip can come off and there are different tips that we can add to it. This is just the uh, standard protective tip here and set that aside. We have one tip here that you can screw on here and this way it has a little hook so if you're doing some exploratory and you need to be able to hook something to pull it out we have this one here which has got a mirror on it so that you can see um, the sides of your cylinder head when it's inside there and uh, one of the really good one too is we have this tip that can go on and it has a magnet on it and that's a fairly strong magnet for you to be able to grab things and to, to scope it out and then grab and pull it out. One thing with using this tip here with the magnet, it does restrict your field of vision a little bit. So depending on what you're looking at, that may inhibit what you're trying to look at. So with our, our camera hooked up to the scanner, then we want to go into the option here from our main home screen to video scope. And then that will connect to the camera or we can see uh, our field of vision there. And then you can be able to put this down in and look at different components. Biggest feature is we want to be able to see inside our um, cylinder head here or any tight confined space that we don't want to take everything apart. So we're going to just take this um, ignition coil out and the spark plug out to be able to uh, gain access to be able to look inside our engine. All right, so with our spark plug removed, as well as the ignition coil, we can now be able to uh, explore and see what potentially is going wrong inside our cylinder in case we need to. Um, checking through the video scope um, on here, now we can see our camera. Now this is without the light turned on, and see we don't, we're not getting as good of clarity there. And so if we just tap the light option here and we turn the light on and we can uh, see pretty good. And we gotta get past the, um, the threads. And now we can see the top side of our cylinder to see how it looks inside there. Now on the uh, camera handle itself, we have the option to tap the button and we can take photos. This tells us where that photo is saved on the device. It saves it on the device, not on this. And then we have our different brightnesses with our light here. And you can also do video record if you hit this option on the screen. And so we can do a video and record as we are um, scoping with, with it. And then stop, and that goes to the same spot there. Now, this is just the uh, 
just the tip to look straight down, but we have that special tip there. And so we want to screw this off and we have a, a tip that has a mirror on it so that we can actually see the sides of the cylinder that we're looking at. So with our um, side mirror attached, we'll now drop this in and we can see the different sides of the cylinder. All right, so you're done taking a, taking a look inside your cylinder um, through the uh, spark plug hole, and now you want to know where um, your pictures that you took or the video you took, where to find it on the scanner unit itself. So back here from the main screen, that's the video scope where you can get into how to use it. But what you need is swipe over here, and we have auxiliary tools and then file browser you're going to tap on that give it a second to bring up the different files and then if you go right here to internal storage you go down here to USB camera and we have the videos right here and then we just say always there that way we can view what we videoed back here we have all the pictures that you may have taken now all of these are saved on the scanner device itself so you can port these over to a USB um, a storage device just by uncook, unhooking the camera unit and plugging your USB device in here and copy and port those over so that you can then take them and look at them on a computer or, or anything to get better um, vision of what you're looking at and so that's where you would find your pictures on your device now of course if you want to if you're done and you want to delete them if you just hold on it it'll pick it up and then you can tap them all and hit the delete function and clear them out to keep uh, your memory down a little bit if you need to that's where you find the, uh, the, your photos and or camera on your, um, your scanner here if you use the video scope, bore scope to be able to check internal components through a, a hole that you can look at things and see how they are. Thanks for watching Mechanic, where you can be the mechanic.